Boston Celtics games are now banned in China over a player's social media post. Ennis Cantor called the country's leader a, quote, brutal dictator. WBC's Levin Reed is live for us tonight. Levin, it would seem like this could be a big problem for the NBA in China. Yes, it is. And by the way, this is not the first trouble between the NBA and China, but it's the first incident involving the Boston Celtics. These big man, Enos Cantor, is very outspoken about human rights, primarily in his land of Turkey. But this last measure supporting Tibetan independence in China has the Celtics banned in China. Brutal dictator of China, Xi Jinping, I have a message for you and your henchmen. I will say it again. Again and again, loud and clear. I hope you hear me. Free Tibet, free Tibet, free Tibet. That's just a bit of an almost three minute message Cantor posted to social media yesterday. As of today, the Celtics games, both live and replays, are now listed as unavailable on the Chinese internet service that streams the NBA. And a Celtics fan account on Chinese social media said it will immediately stop posting about the team. Cantor did not play in last night's Celtics opener, but was wearing these free Tibet shoes on the sidelines. There is no comment from the Celtics today or the NBA on the situation. And if you remember, it was back 2019 where it was the Houston Rockets and Daryl Morey. They said some things, and all of a sudden, the Houston Rockets were banned also from the Chinese streaming service.